Hey there, in this video I'm going to share the top 10 new features that I feel are a huge improvement in Windows Phone 8.1. This is Ranjit and I have this Lumia 630 which comes pre-installed with the Windows Phone 8.1 and I feel Windows 8.1 is a huge improvement over Windows Phone 8 and I'm going to share the top 10 features that I feel are a huge improvement on Windows Phone 8.1. So here we have this Windows Phone 8.1 and we have a lot of improvements by just looking at it it looks familiar like windows 8 but again the first thing is this notification tray and here you get all the notification for example i have a whatsapp if you get any sms emails etc they will be displayed here and from here you can directly let's say i have this whatsapp message you can just click here and it opens that appropriate app as you can see here so let me just get out of that and now let me again show you this notification tray we also have other notification we can swipe away the notifications like this if you want and clear them off and we also have some quick toggles over here and you can have up to four toggles and these can also be customized for example right now i have wi-fi bluetooth quiet hours and this brightness setting and we can go to our all settings from here and if we just go to this notification tab over here and we see all those notifications and we can change it for example let's change the bluetooth i don't want bluetooth and instead of that let's say i want this internet sharing and now we have internet sharing so we have this notification tray and the quick toggles and that is customizable the next important thing is if we go to the settings uh, let's first check out this uh, uh, battery saver option that we have it's a new thing and if we go to this battery saver it gives you an idea about the battery how much battery is left and we can also enable the battery saver option apart from that it also gives you an idea about the usage which app is actually using the battery so using this you can track down if a app is misbehaving and what is consuming the most battery on your windows phone moving on uh, one more great thing about windows 8.1 is that if your windows phone supports sd card for example this is the lumia 630 it has a sd card we can now actually install all the uh, games apps etc directly to the sd card and if we just go down here to the uh, the storage sense here as you can see uh, we have the sd card option and we just have a simple drop down here from here you can just choose what kind of apps for example photos etc you want it to be on your phone or the sd card and you can also store all the apps this is really important to the sd card and i've installed a lot of apps and even heavy games and they are installing properly on the sd card i would say 95 percent of the apps are getting installed directly on the sd card so i feel that's a huge improvement we also have one more thing that is known as data sense and this tracks uh, the data for example let's say your mobile data is limited for example in my case uh, I have installed this 350 meg uh, of data pack and we can set that limit for example let's say you have one gig or whatever you can enter that and it gives you an idea uh, uh, what is being used for example let me just show you and if you just go back here actually if you go to this data sense it actually gives you an idea what is consuming your data for example as you just seen we had set the uh, 3g data limit to 350 meg and it says out of that 350 meg i've uh, used uh, i have 326 mb remaining and the number of days and you also have further settings that takes you back to the data sense so you can also track down the actual usage for example where you have used that data which apps etc so again i feel this is a huge improvement another new improvement is uh, i don't know if this is enabled for all devices because uh, uh, this lumia 630 came pre-installed with windows 8.1 and we have this uh, bing uh, health for example and it has built-in pedometer sensors using which it can track the number of steps that you have taken for example let it just load and as you can see it's showing us that today i have walked 173 steps and this uh, at least the lumia 630 has built in hardware that is pedometer that shows you this info and we can again do the analysis for example it shows me the last seven days that i've walked or uh, last 30 days etc so we do have built-in uh, pedometer functionality using this bing health and fitness app 
so that's also new on windows phone 8.1 and uh, now coming to the keyboard let me just fire up this internet explorer we have the new internet explorer that is uh, 11 and we have this new keyboard and i feel the keyboard is pretty good it's pretty fast and we also have the swipe like functionality for example let's say you have that and it also gives you prediction and in my testing i would say the keyboard was pretty responsive and uh, the swipe functionality also works great so that's the new keyboard also if we go to the settings uh, again let me just go back we also have wireless uh, uh, streaming uh, that is miracast for example we have the option called project uh, your sc my screen and if you have a miracast enabled device it will work with that so this is also a new thing now coming to the virtual voice uh, assistant we have Cortana on Windows Phone 8.1 and it works actually pretty well I have already made a dedicated video regarding that uh, but to give you an idea you just press this home uh, search button for a while and it will activate and now you can ask questions for example let me just ask uh, cancel that and ask uh, what's the weather like and it works actually pretty well it's currently 100 and partly cloudy and the scutana is actually pretty witty if you ask some silly question gives you back uh, silly answers for example uh, let's uh, ask one question what do you think about bill gates i quite literally can't imagine a world without him <laughs> let me ask one more which is better windows phone or iphone oh come on chief windows phone actually i have made a dedicated video regarding this so you can check that out also uh, you can also say something like this call my wife i'm sorry i didn't get that let me try again call my wife and as you can see it recognized that uh, uh, this was my wife's number and it is calling so you can give the stuff like that call my mom etc and the first time you do that it will ask you from your address book who's your mom etc and th that way it works and i would say the kutana on this works very well by default uh, kutana won't be enabled if you are in the asian regions it's only right now enabled for in us regions but i have already made a video regarding how you can enable kutana if you are running the windows phone 8.1 so check out that video link will be in the youtube show notes now the multitasking also has been changed a little bit uh, we have this back arrow and if you press it for a while you get to the recent apps and from here let's say you just want to uh, remove this app you can just swipe away down like this and it gets killed so this is the new multitasking on this windows 8.1 and uh, also windows 8.1 finally brings support for dual sim uh, windows phone uh, obviously this lumia 630 is a dual sim and if you notice closely we have two phone icons this is for the sim one and this is for the sim two so these are some of the major improvements that i've seen on windows phone 8.1 i've already made some other videos also on windows 8.1 so make sure that you check them out also if you're not subscribed to my youtube channel subscribe to the same thank you this is ranjit and i hope to see you in my next video